what's up taurus this is gonna be your reading taurus um thank you guys for joining me on another video wow look at that look at the way the light is coming in okay that's beautiful um anyway sorry y'all so yeah taurus um this is your reading if, this, if you're new here welcome okay don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe I'm so excited, y'all. I have a new deck, and this is what we're using today. I just want to say, you know, if you don't know any, much about me, okay, I am obsessed with The Little Mermaid. I found these cards on Etsy, Julia's Messages. They're called the Un Under the Sea Tarot. I've always been obsessed with The Little Mermaid, okay? So, y'all just going to have to, you're going to have to deal. If you don't like The Little Mermaid, that's your preference. That's your choice, but the messages will come out. So we're going to tap in and see. Um, I'm going to try to get these message, messages out before my daughter wakes up. I have a newborn. So, yeah, I if I'm not, you know, as look at how beautiful these are. Gold edges. OK, they're so cute. <sighs> I feel like all I feel like everyone who was like an introvert or. You know before you even knew what an introvert was or if you were like an empath in high school if you were like an empath in middle school you loved the little mermaid like that's just like an unwritten rule or something i don't know but we're gonna tap in and see what these messages are but yeah you guys if my messages have been like scattered if i haven't been like i'm trying to be like more on schedule with my messages especially on my other channel it's in the description box, but I just had a child like two or three weeks ago. And yeah, my night, the nighttime feedings, I am, ooh, I'm nursing, you know, and it's just, it's, it's a lot, it's a lot. But okay, we're going to get into these readings, y'all. I am dealing with a lot. Plus I work, plus I have another child, plus I'm a wife. So, you know, so yeah, yeah. <laughs> we got the five of swords uh, flying out here. Oh, okay. We're going to talk about it. So yeah, I'm getting towards like something is connected to your energy. Okay. Something is connected to your energy. It has a direct connection with your, um, with how something comes out so when you're super tired or when you're really really um i feel like you have a lot going on because why did i just feel the need to give all of that information like taurus i feel like you guys have a lot going on you may have your hand in like five different pots okay i'm getting um it's gonna take a while to adjust to the energy i don't know why i feel the need to show y'all though like baby wear baby wear okay Waste where? Which waste? What waste? Yeah. <laughs> Proud of myself. No, anyway. <laughs> so, yeah, Taurus. Oh, my gosh. All right. I'm getting, like, Leo energy. The strength card. I don't know why I'm saying the strength card in my head. But, yeah, so, Taurus. Something. I'm all over the place. The tower. Taurus, something is directly connected to your energy. Why is this not charging? That's so weird. Okay. I don't know. Anyway. Yeah, something is directly connected to your energy. Um, you, wow, something about energy, electricity. Something is not charging. It's like, okay, this is weird. Okay, um... You need a break, Taurus. You need a break. You do. Yeah, the five of wands, five of pentacles. Oh, my goodness. I feel like, you know, something is something is trying to test you. I said that in the other 425. Something is trying to test you. Something is trying to um, combat you or come up against you. Um, it's a test, okay? You're going to bypass this energy, though. You are going to bypass the energy tour. So let's see. Let's just get into the reading. All right. So, yeah. Take my coffee out of the way. All right, Spirit. What messages do we need to know for my Taurus? Okay, Taurus. 
let's see messages for you hopefully my phone doesn't die i don't know all right messages for taurus what's going on we have the ace of pentacles ace of swords wow okay so really fresh energy coming out ace of pentacles all right, there is a brand new beginning coming in here for you. I'm getting some type of new communication. Wow, the Wheel of Fortune. What did I say? This energy is going to bypass. So like I said, in the beginning, you guys saw, yeah, the Six of Cups. Um, In the beginning, there was all these fives coming out, right? So um, Taurus, you know, there's some type of situation you're in right now. Something's going to change. There is new opportunities, new... Uh, an opportunity for you to discuss something or somebody is going to see you is what I'm getting. I feel like somebody's going to see you like you are a knight in shining armor or somebody's about to meet their knight in shining armor if that even exists. Okay. We got the seven of swords. Yeah. Look at that. Ursula. Uh-huh. Okay. But justice. But justice is here. So the seven of swords, somebody was trying to get off on your energy. Yeah, the page of swords, somebody who had been watching you. Um, I'm also getting, you're going to get a front row seat to something. Yeah, there it is, the five of wands. See, somebody is playing, messing with your energy, Taurus. I'm getting something or someone. Also, I don't know if you guys, for some reason, you know how sometimes... If you guys see angel numbers or messages from spirit or something like that, but for some reason lately I've been seeing three, three, like for the past, I don't know, couple of weeks, everything is three, three. So it could be six, 33, seven, 33, five, 33. I just see the numbers three, three everywhere. And I really don't know what that's about. If you know, put it in the comments below. Um, but yeah, Taurus, here we go. What is this seven of swords? Also, somebody is a shapeshifter. This, this bit, okay. This is what she's. This is what somebody really looks like behind. But they're coming like this. They've changed their body, so somebody could really look different, okay. Somebody could really look different. But see, the justice card uh, um, is here, watching someone do whatever this is that they're doing. All right, we're gonna put those back. That's too many. There's a new opportunity now. Um, I'm also getting towards you could meet somebody. Here you are, the Empress. Oh, such a beautiful card. Such a beautiful card. But it's that's a lot. All right. Come on, Spirit. What is the message here? What's the Ace of Pentacles? Sorry, y'all. If I if I seem all over the place, this coffee got me on one, okay? Uh, the Six of Pentacles. Yeah, there's a new opportunity for you to be, um, somebody's going to give something to you, okay? Or you're giving something to other people. But there's like a sharing of resources here, sharing of energies. You're able to give back to something from your past or somebody that supported you in the past, okay? Yeah, because look, she has this new baby. So this is from the second episode or, or second, uh, version or whatever but she has this new baby here yeah the emperor so the emperor could be giving to you or somebody that you really love i feel like especially um yeah there's like a sharing of resources here let me see what why is the six of pentacles here for taurus we have the five of cups because somebody's you see that somebody is left out in the cold or this is how they feel about you somebody sees that you're sad depressed about something yeah the ace of cups so I'm seeing like somebody um come around Taurus because they're going to see that you have been tired or like disappointed or just like somebody sees, that's what I was getting. Like somebody is going to um see that you have been really sad about something. There's like a new opportunity coming in because I'm not getting that you're sad about it, but I'm getting that you're tired. Like you're tired, you're, you 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 know you got your hands in a lot of things. So I'm I'm seeing somebody like come in and be like, hey, I don't know what this is. I don't know why I heard go on a trip. Okay, so somebody could be um flying you out or like I don't know. Maybe you're 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 doing something. You're going on a date night or you're doing something here. What is this? 
Yeah, the Nine of Cups. What did I say? Oh, so you getting dressed up. You about to um they could be somebody could be giving you like a um a spa trip or they're just granting all of these wishes for you. 1010. Yeah. Somebody wants you to be happy. I'm getting like a a night on the town or like you know, they're gonna I don't know why I'm getting like somebody wants to get you a new outfit, take you out to dinner. Like I'm getting a real shining okay. So if you're a masculine energy here, okay. <laughs> Hi, first of all. But if you're a masculine energy, I'm getting like um something is coming towards you here. I'm getting it could be a feminine energy. This person now they want to give you everything or they want to um open up now. So you know what I'm saying, okay? Somebody wants to um open their heart towards you or something. Let's see, what's the ace of swords? For Taurus so two aces there's definitely new beginnings coming in yeah the fool a brand new beginning baby the ace of swords new communication um I'm getting fresh communication like after this night out all of a sudden you're feeling brand new you're like oh my god I didn't even know that I could feel like this I didn't know that the two of wands yeah you chose you made the right choice what's the fool whoa the king of cups you see yeah so now you're feeling refreshed you're feeling like you know i just heard i'm the man what is that song yeah, bitch, I'm the man. God, no, man, do my wife, be my girlfriend. What? I haven't heard that song in so long. Wow, yeah. So you're feeling like the man now, the high priestess. Ooh, you feeling like the hot, your highness, okay? Yeah, you feeling like your, your highness, you are. Mm. I'm hearing even with you keeping to yourself or even keeping something to yourself, like your emotions or something, yeah, the Empress, the Ten of Swords, exactly. Like, even though you've been through this dark period or this time where things just, you know, it felt like you had to get a lot of stuff done, you still feel like your highness? That's kind of like what I'm getting from the last reading as well, okay. Oh, my goodness, Taurus, these cards have given me, okay. So, what is this Seven of Swords? Because, what is this? What is the seven of swords for Taurus here? We have the ace of wands and the temperance. Mm-hmm. 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 Okay. So we got the seven of swords, the ace of wands, and the temperance here. Um, there you are again, the empress at the bottom of the deck so somebody sees somebody wants to take i heard take what's yours okay somebody literally wants to take what's yours they think they can i'm not sure why this energy is coming out it feels very different than this okay so yeah i feel like somebody sees that you're very like tempered you know you, you're peaceful you're trying out different things okay um you're enlightened and it's like somebody thinks that they can put their hands on that sorry i got a notification yeah somebody thinks they can put their hands on it or take it um there may be even people watching this person i'm getting a spirit i'm getting a spirit okay look at these people behind her her sisters her ancestors or whatever I'm getting um this person's, yeah, justice card. Yeah, and the page of swords. Yeah, somebody's watching this person. Okay, I'm getting it's their own ancestors or their own um whoo, child. Okay, what's the justice page of swords? Yeah, somebody is disappointed. Look at the way he's looking. Somebody is disappointed here and and what someone else is doing um towards you. Wow, the three of swords, exactly yeah oh my goodness okay 
you have the hierophant the cherry and the queen of cups because see this is your energy here you could have cancer in your energy but the hierophant the cherry and the queen of cups you're very loving okay you're moving forward passionately about something the hierophant you have a lot of knowledge somebody is watching that You're very passionate. See, you got a lot of things going on. Somebody else could be worried. Look at them. Here you are, though, excited, moving forward. Somebody else is like, whoa, wait. Oh, my gosh. Wait a minute. You you got a lot going on. Some shit, okay? Something. Something. But it doesn't matter. Even though even though you, you walk around like this, Taurus, I don't know if y'all can see how excited she is in this card. This is you on the inside, though. You're very knowledgeable. All right, very knowledgeable, um, very sweet, very kind, very loving Taurus, as we know you are. 555 five, five on the clock. Um, yeah, just period. And we're ending on the High Priestess. So you have the Hierophant and the High Priestess. The Three of Pentacles. Oh, wow. Yeah, it's like you're yearning for something. Look at how she's staring like she really wants this, okay? So there's something that you're like really wanting to work out. You want this. This is this is unbeknownst to anybody else, though, the high priestess. This is something that you're keeping um, to yourself. Yeah, the strength card. You're going to be able, yeah, the two of wands. You are going to be able to work this out or, or make this happen or something. All right, so yeah, that is beautiful. I'm obsessed with these cards, y'all. All right, so let me see. Let's get some um, energy oracles. Let's get some oracle cards real quick for Taurus. Guys, this is just a general reading. If you want a personal, you can email me below. <laughs> I was about to say, let me know if y'all like the Little Mermaid cards. Um, but it don't matter. Because <laughs> I would not. I, mean, I was going to say, I could take them away and just use them for myself. But like... Okay, so Taurus, somebody thinks that, like, they have a say in, like, what you do or something. Like, you love this person very much, but, yeah, appreciation. Okay, I'm getting somebody's going to appreciate you no matter what. It's okay. Like, they do appreciate you or something like that. All right, what else for Taurus? Or somebody's going to show you how much they appreciate you. Yeah, we have the uh, the third eye. Okay, Archangel Metatron. One more for Taurus. And the healer of the ages. Yeah, this always looks like the um the higher font to me. And you also have um 15 and 51. These images are like mirroring each other. These numbers are mirroring each other. So I'm getting like you have a lot of knowledge with the third eye here. Very spiritual individual. Okay, you're here to help people, healer of the ages. People are, are appreciating whatever this is that you do. Yeah, we got victory. All right. So, yeah. Let's get um a message from the ancients. Taurus. I'm also getting clarification. I'm hearing the word clarification. I'm getting you're going to get a confirmation. We have knowledge. You're going to get confirmation from your angels or from spirit in some type of way. Pay attention. Okay, because so I'm getting you You are gaining confirmation. Yeah, we have projection. Yeah, somebody's been projecting on you. Could have been doing mirror magic. Or they could have been looking at your picture or some, something like that. But you're about to become very certain about some type of energy that somebody was projecting on you. Okay. Yeah. Um, I'm getting, I'm hearing the word advice. Okay, so let me get a one card of advice for Taurus here. The next couple of days. See, 1933. I don't know. What is that, 33? Okay, um, advice for Taurus. Yeah, we have the Seven of Pentacles, the Knight of Cups, the Seven of Cups. So two sevens, some type of spiritual message here. This is very spiritual. This is from 
this is a warning and we have the king of cups and we have the emperor So this is your advice, something here that you've been waiting for or you've been really investing in it, okay? It's going to work out with the Knight of Cups. Something is going to give back to you. The Seven of Cups. Now, this could be something that you put your heart into. Something is giving back to you. They're going to give you options. This could be love, work, whatever. I'm getting in love. If you've been like investing in it and, and you know, putting all your time into something or someone, you know, you've been trusting this person. I'm getting, it's going to, it's going to, um... Something's going to happen. I'm getting on the 14th. I'm getting something about um, about Valentine's Day. All right. Whenever you watch this or whatever. Yeah. Somebody really loves you or something. You have the Emperor, the Nine of Pentacles. Um, but if this is work or you are a masculine energy as well, I'm getting like um, something is coming back to you. Okay. Yes. The Ten of Pentacles. Yeah. I'm getting somebody's going to give to you financially or, yeah, the Page of Cups, the Death card, the the um, the Justice. If something that has to transform. Somebody wants to transform something with you or, all right, that's what I have for you, Taurus. I love you guys. Um, don't forget to follow the other channel and I'll see you in the next reading.